12, 19, it's Jamila's 24. I'm 24. This is the year I'm supposed to be the most excited for, like I really? said. We said 24 would be a good year because all the K-pop idols seems like they had a really good glow up, good year when they're 24. I'm starting to feel like my now. <laughs> Technically, I'm not 24 yet. I haven't. I wasn't born at this time yet. I was born at 12:34 p.m. PST. So, you know how in Chinese it's "sang ya fai lao," right? Uh huh. I, I would tell her "sang all fai lao." Cups. I don't right. need a shower last that, night. That that ends our conversation. Happy birthday, Jamila. You can continue your bed rituals. Okay. Good night. Bye bye. I actually got jam. later happy birthday to me honestly i was gonna go out and do some stuff like do some taking myself on a date and then i was gonna meet up my friend at four to go to pet cafes but then i woke up and i was just feeling really tired and lazy so honestly i just stayed back today ate the cake that vicky got me it was very very good with strawberry and then i also watched spider-man far from home or no spider-man homecoming and i'm on the second movie far from home because i've never seen it before and honestly it was just a very very chill day and i enjoyed it and now i'm heading off to dinner with vicky jenny and joyce we're getting shabu shabu and i put on lashes today like i have not put on lashes in forever and i'm wearing this new top that i got the other day from um slow express station i'll see you guys at dinner look at this mushroom they literally cut the mushroom off. Yeah, that's right. I'm a joy. I'm <laughs> Joyce and Jenny. Yeah. This looks so good. Okay, okay. What is this called? Porridge. Oh, oh wait, wait, what? In Korean? Oh, this is in Chinese. It's really? Yeah. Oh, oh. So, this is what you do at the end of the shabu shabu. They put in the rice and stuff, and it's really, really good. And yes, I knew it was porridge. I know English. <laughs> I was asking for the Korean. <laughs> so, this is the end of the night. We finished six bottles between three people. We had a lot of talk in between. Finished some chips. You guys, these chips are actually so good. I think these are my... Not that I snack a lot, but these... <laughs> Sorry, I'm vlogging. But these chips are probably the best thing, like best chips I had or like snack that I had in Korea. Like, but it tastes like seaweed, I think. Is it seaweed? What? This chip? I don't think it's seaweed. Oh, but it's really good. You guys should try it. I don't know how to describe the taste. Fev 16 actually just started in America. Oh my God. Oh my Lord. Jesus, I haven't taken off this last bit of eyeliner. <laughs> but yeah, it's still technically Fev 14 in America. So it's still my birthday. Or Chinese to start on my birthday in America time. I haven't even been born yet, so I'm still in my mom's tummy right now. Probably she's going through labor and she's like, "Get the fuck out," kind of thing. But I'm just not getting the fuck out, so I'll be getting the fuck out soon. Good night. Good morning. Um, so it's currently 11, and I slept in because we went to sleep at like 3 a.m. yesterday. But yesterday was so much fun. We came back to Vicky's place and then. We played the stringing game and we just basically drank and we talked a lot. It was just, honestly, it was just a very chill but very fun birthday. I'm really glad that I was able to celebrate with Vicky and the two new friends that I met. I didn't have any expectations or I even think about like how to do my birthday when I was in Korea, but this was just like a really nice birthday. Like we didn't really do much. We went to Shabu Shabu, which was delicious. It was probably one of the fullest meals I had in Korea. And I didn't cry this year. 
I don't want to say it, but basically ever since I turned 18, I've cried every single year on my birthday because there's just like some sort of reason for me to cry. Like I just get way too drunk and then my emotions pile up and I just cry. But this year, one, I like kind of like nothing to cry about, but two, I didn't get like super drunk for me to feel those type of emotions. So, you know, applause on my back um, or applause for myself. The only reason why I would cry is like if Sharon's not coming to Korea and I get sad, so then if I do cry, then that's on her. Order some bean sprout soup, so we're waiting for that to come. And in the meantime, I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I already knew that Vicky and Sharon would get me something because I actually saw them texting like, what's your budget? But I didn't expect Jenny and Joyce would get me anything. I was like, oh my God. Jenny got me some beauty products from this company and this company is actually founded by a person who used to work at Vanilla Co. Vanilla Co's Cleansing Balm is like my most favorite thing ever. I've been using it since like almost like beginning of college. So it's my ride or die go to. Holy Grail. Yeah, so she got me this cleansing balm. But I really like that they have this lid right here that you can open up like this instead of like twisting it. I don't know how to describe the smell, but it's like familiar. Kind of reminds me of like hotels. Mm, like hotels. like spa. Yeah, yeah, like spa, hotels, toiletries. Oh, the pack packaging is so cute. This is a hydro gel eye patch. Oh my gosh, I use this right now. I don't wash my face yet though. Oh, these are individual eye patches. Joyce got me this little flower. That's so cute. Cookies. Wow, I love packaging here. So cute. Ooh, crunchy. Oh, that sounds very crunchy. Yummy. Thanks, Joyce. Thanks, Jenny. Time to try on the jacket. Vicky's like behind the camera right now, I've been waiting for me to try it. Oh, oh I love that it's cropped! Oh my god, it's sleeves inside! Thanks, Sharon! Thanks, Vicky! No, it's okay. You're welcome. I'm not wearing my glasses right now, so I can't see shit. <laughs> this is so cute! Nice. If you guys like soju, or kind of like these type of alcohol, try this. Because this tastes so much better than the clean and fresh soju like it's a little bit sweeter and it doesn't have as much of that like spicy aftertaste okay that is it for my morning festivities see you guys in a bit good afternoon okay so i last talked to you guys yesterday morning it was right after my birthday and then i just like show you guys what i got and then after that i was supposed to be a little productive but then I didn't. I was a little tired because we drank the night before instead of like 3 a.m. So then I just stayed back and watched Spider Man and like I just went on this Marvel movie binge. And I don't know, like ever since like my career quarantine, I just love Marvel so much more. Like I've always liked it and I follow up with like all the movies. Now I have this new like this kind of like love for them and I kind of like rewatch the movies over and over. I think this brown mascara is a tap it lights for me, but you know, we'll roll with it. I can't find my Velvet Heady lipstick, so I'm gonna use Honey Love. This is my second favorite lipstick color. Makeup is done. This is today's OOTD. I just have this top on and I have a bra top inside. My trusty old dad jeans. And oh my god, this is the first time I'm getting it on after washing it. And shit's so tight. I swear getting your jeans on after you finish washing it for that like first wear is it's so hard, it's so tight. Like I'm, I feel like I'm breaking a sweat right now. I'm just gonna turn off the heater in this house. And I'm wearing the new crop puffer that Vicky and Sharon got me for my birthday. And it's so cute, I love it. This is really so good. And then I got a fish cake, oh. And they always give you like a cup of soup or something and it feels really good because it's like cool right now. Oh God. Hey vlog, what is up? Um, this is a very busy street right now. So this is me getting over my fear of vlogging in public. Go jam! Every week making new progress, but it's currently Friday, so happy Friday. I'm walking over to the coffee shop that I'm gonna be doing work at. So I got a little hungry, so I stopped by one of the stalls to get um, the two things that I got, and it was so good. And it was just like the perfect amount to kind of fill in this little hungerness that I have. Today's weather is also like really really nice. It's a little bit of wind, a little bit of sun, and it's not too cold. It's literally like the perfect amount of breeze. Can I see it in my hair? Like it just 
bounces very nicely. Hello, it's a few hours later and I got a lot of eating done. I got really, really hungry and my head kind of hurts because I think it's from the coffee. So I ordered food so that it will arrive when I get home, but I'm gonna grab something really quick from the CU, which is a convenience store, before I go back. The CU is so big, like it has tables. It has tables over there that you can sit. This is like the biggest CU I've been into. <gasps> they have macros. Oh my gosh, I get it. Rice cakes. Well, I don't want. Ooh, this looks really good. Yeah, I thought I was get real food, but I couldn't really find anything that I really want to eat. So I'm just gonna hold it out until I get home. But I got two desserts. I got the macaroons, macaroons, and then I got this chocolate rice cake. So I got the desserts solved. I think that's my food by the door. Yes, it is. Yes. I got it. I'm so excited. Perfect timing. Okay, time to go in. Home sweet home. Vicky's not back yet. Woo! Okay, I really need pee. I am so freaking excited to eat. Oh my god. No. Oh. Sorry, I have to use brute force with that. I got two because I always just save the other one for like another day or something. This one is steak and egg. And this one is tuna and kimchi. I think I'm feeling the tuna just a little bit more. Also, on the way back, or like on the way to the subway, I stopped by another convenience store. And I was like, oh, maybe they have other food there, like actual food that I wanted. So I went in and I did get something, but they didn't have a table to eat. And I was like, okay, maybe I could just like as I'm walking and eating but then I realized I was like so close to the subway station I've never seen anyone eat on the subway station before so I'm just assuming like you can't eat on the subway station that's why it's like so clean all the time so I was like okay I'll just hurry back I also got an apple because I have not eaten fruits for a really long time the only fruits I get is literally from the fruit juice I drink at the quantum market this is the salted seafood with seeds I have no idea what it is I want a tuna one but they didn't have a tuna one Mmm, the rice is a little cold, a little hard because it's been in the fridge. Also, I want to quickly show you guys the site that I use to watch all my movies and TV shows. It's called MoviesToWatch.tv, and it's essentially a streaming site. If your country or if you don't need a UP UPN VPN to use it, then it's legal in your country. I don't really know how it works, and it literally has every single movie or TV show you could think of. I was trying to search up like Ham and Hannah or um, Sweet Life of Zack and Cody at every season, every episode. So I really like this site, and it has um, HD options, and it also comes with like a lot of different sub subtitles that you could use. Okay, taste test time. What's this little thing? This is just uh, some radish that they give you. Look. The yolk is just still a little bit runny. I love like a runny yolk with rice and I'm just gonna mix this all in. This is kind of hard mix with one hand. Okay, I'm gonna put this back down. A little bit of rice, a little bit of kimchi, a little bit of tuna, a little bit of the egg. Damn, this is one big bite. Mmm! Before Korea, I feel like I've never really eaten like tuna like this very often. But now that I have it, I love the taste of it. So good. This is literally my most favorite scene in the entire Winter Soul dress. This man literally does not age. So I'm trying one of the macaroons that I got from the convenience store. And it's really good. There's a little bit of blueberry jam. This is so good for like a convenience store. Yeah, so I'm gonna finish off my nights with this macaroon. Maybe another one. I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Bye!